Yeah, you hit mellow? Okay. We got it. Cool. All right, what do we got now? So we got Shaman on Shaman. Oh, man, the Shamans. The Shaman Mirror. This is honestly, like, one of the most annoying matchups in the game right now. Shaman Mirrors and Druid Mirrors are very, very annoying to play because they're very coin-dependent. Now, Aggro Shaman versus Aggro Shaman, or, or Ooh, no, I'm sorry. No, it's Mid Shaman on Mellow's side versus Aggro Shaman on Mr. Make It Rain's side. So this is honestly... Who uh, wins? It's a, it's very, very, very polarizing and very dependent on the start of the game. Like, Mr. Make It Rain played Trog on one, and Mellow had the answer with Rockbiter because he kept it on the coin, which is correct. And now Mr. Make It Rain needs to find his Totem Golem, and he didn't. Finding Totem Golem is like the best card in the entire matchup. You just, having Totem Golem on turn one or two in this matchup is game changing. Wow. So Mello has double thing from below, which is very scary. Very scary. Once he charges it. High roll? High roll Totem? Yup, game over. Sorry boys, that's the game. <laughs> he, when you roll Tuskar Totemic and hit Totem Golem, that's the game. So yeah, Mr. Make It Rain's kind of in a shit position now. Yeah, that's uh, Tuskar Totemic. Can't wait till that card's gone, cause God is it annoying. <laughs> what do you mean annoying? You love Tuskar Totemic when you're playing it. Well, obviously everybody loves it when they get to high roll with things, but you know. Oh wow, he's gonna try to make this abusive play and kill the Tuskar, but he is literally gonna get so blown out by Maelstrom Portal. Get in there, yeah, that sucks. That sucks really hard. He it happens, though. He doesn't know he has it. Yeah, but... Ah, oh, yeah. So gross. Are people replacing Lightning Storm with Maelstrom Portal at this point? A guaranteed two damage it across the board? Uh, some mid-shaman lists have cut Lightning Storm completely and okay. only run two portals. Oh, okay. And then okay. some aggro shaman lists run one portal, one storm. Okay. Wow, that's the best top deck in the game for uh, Mellow right there, is the Totem Golem. Wow. Yeah, Mr. Mega Rain is not too pleased with this play because uh, he hit the Totem Golem from Tuscar, and that's just... Oh, but he's got Feral Spirit, so he's fine. He can keep going. Yeah, Totem Golem from Tuscar is this like... This is a tight game because no one has, no one has the... It looks tight. It, it lo looks okay. tight. It okay, so, looks explain, tight. so explain it to me. What's what? Who's winning right now? Uh, Mello? Mello. Mello. Look at his hand. It's so high value. It's so high value. He has double thing from below. He can play Fire Elemental. He's playing Elemental. Fire Elemental can, next turn. Ooh. Ooh. That's the punish, though. That's the punish. That's the hard punish. He top decked the storm, the one of storm. Mello, that's Mello's huge. nodding. Yeah. I dude. mean, that's huge though. That's re that really changes the game because it lets M Mr. Make It Rain start pushing face with his seven seven. Damn. But I mean, hey, Mello hit the totem golem off Tuscar, so you can't have everything in life. Sometimes, sometimes they top deck the storm when you go wide. All right. So yeah, he's gonna Flame fire. He's late. gonna fire Ellie. But this is really, 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 really good for Mr. Make It Rain. Because he gets the Lava Burst to Fire Ellie and then just keep pushing face with the 7-7. Seven, seven. And the 7-7 seven, is going to end the game if if he can't find an answer. He has the second thing from below, but, you know. Oh, double Doomhammer draw. Ooh, that's a big one. Taunt Totem. That's a good one. Taunt Totem's good. Just really good. Target dummy. Oh, top decks the hex. You huge, got your answer. Huge. Oh, he he's he's inefficient. He should have told him. Mana inefficient. If he would have told him, the thing from below would have cost uh would have cost two instead of three, and he would have wow. been able to play both. It's a it's a it's a minor misplay, but it happens. Sometimes people forget about the discount and don't really see it right away. If in doubt, count. Yes. Ooh, he's gonna trade count. in both of his. Uh, replacing it with a three one. Nice. Yeah, he he. He killed the totem off first because he wanted taunt totem again. That's gotcha. Yeah, yeah, that's that's yeah. how you have to rotate that yeah. in. Correct sequencing. Ooh, spirit claws is good. Wow, why didn't you play thunder bluff? <laughs> he just face palms so hard and you... he knows it. Oh, so God. today I learned that uh, oh, we got psychic power. Oh it. man, he can't even handle it. Oh yeah, he's wow. like he's like I'm, he's like I'm so fucking stupid. Oh, uh, it happens, though. It happens. No, oh, whoa! No, he didn't play Thunder Bluff. That's big. Not playing Thunder Bluff is really a problem there. You need to... Oh. 
Wow, Finley is like the best draw. That's the now, best draw. Now, do you draw. Finley before yes, or after Doom Hammer? You discover to play around getting life tap. So that you life Damn. tap and have enough mana to play whatever you get. Yep. Ooh, steady shock, shape shift. shape shift. No, shape shift on uh, Doom Hammer. Oh, yeah, it's way better. Oh, oh yeah. no, this is this No, is I, I made that mistake. I, yeah, I picked. This is uh, sick. Well, the steady I, shot doesn't really matter. Steady shot or shape shift were fine. This way, you just gain well, one you, life. He has get, double Doom one. Hammer, so you want the shape shift so that instead of pushing four damage, you're pushing six. Well, you're still pushing six with steady shot, though. Four from Doom Hammer. Uh, two. It's six to face, but not six to board if necessary. I guess. E it's, okay, it's, okay, it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, yeah, it's, it's All a right, minor. so here comes the late Thunder Bluff. Yeah, We've Mello got... looks pretty pretty sad because yeah. he knows he, he made a misplay. Do you, do you the... play the flame time? I would. Yeah, I mean, you you're... Oh, no, you play it to, guarantee, to get the attack on it. You need yep. to get the attack. No, you play it first. Wow, that's like the only Dude. card. No, he's dead. He's dead. He's just dead on board. No, I forgot about the Druid hero power. Yeah, he's just dead. He's just dead. He needed Taunt Totem. Taunt Totem was the only thing that kept him alive. Yeah. Oh, God. Feels bad, man. Wow. When you, when you make a, you know, minor misplay and get punished for it, it never feels great. But that's what happens. It's Hearthstone. Sometimes you, you sequence wrong and you get punished. But, you know. Well, he sequenced, he sequenced wrong and then he played wrong. Just because yeah. he, he didn't put yeah, down no, Thunder exactly. Bluff. He, he, he kind of needed to. But I've been in that position so many times where you make the misplay and then you don't play the card that, you know, defined Ooh, your misplay because you don't want the opponent yeah. to know, like, how, how bad you fucked up. It happens. It happens. Sure. Ooh, okay. So we got Zoo versus Tempo Mage. And this matchup is typically won by the Zoo player almost every time. Because... What Tempo Mage is best at doing with is playing their first threat, like Mana Worm on one, and then dealing with single creatures every turn after that, so that their Mana Worm continues to push. But the Zoo Lock is going to put in so many minions in the early game that it's probably never going to get through. Gotcha. No, I know. I, I tried, to, tried to make it. This is kind of how I like it, though. It's like right, right there. Yeah. So, Mr. Make It Rain had the best opener he could. Flame Wake, I mean, uh, Flame Imp, Coin, uh, Voidwalker. Because now the Mana Worm can't kill the Voidwalker. And he gets the Demon Fire value. Oh, this is so big. Yeah. Mr. Make It Rain shakes his head because he knows he has the punish. That's the real life punish. Wow, Mellow's face. Mellow just whips his head back in his chair like, wow, I haven't ever seen that card played. Wow, this is crazy. Cause he's gonna get the he has the second demon fire too, which is really, really good. But yeah, he's gonna cult sorcerer images. That keeps board. Denies uh Mega Rain the kill. I wonder if Mr. Mega Rain's gonna make the play of just demon firing for tempo here to keep his 5-5 on board. That'd be pretty sick. I think it's right. Oh no, no, that's better. No, what am I talking about? Yeah, you definitely just demon fire. Plane. And then you play that to force a ping. You play that to force him to use his hero power on your 2-1. Keeping uh, tempo. Yeah. Which is the whole point. Ooh! Blood Mage Explosion's good, though. Blood Mage Explosion is just good. Yeah, you play it. No, you play the Blood Mage Explosion. You do it. You get it out there. Because you get the draw out there, which is really the most important part. It's just getting the draw from Thalnos on the board. Because you need to have it die first. Why would you Arcane Explosion with... See, he's... He, it's just like... It's a different line of play, you know? He's making the play where he wants to arcane and elect and then ping next turn and have Thalnos in hand for his spells. Sure. Which is a different line. Me personally, I would just get the Thalnos on board to draw. Because in this matchup, you can't ever really deal with Zoo flooding the board. And the best way you deal with flooding the board well, is... Well, is with Arcane Explosion, which he just played. Well, you, not even that. Just having Thalnos on board so that you have the spell damage for your spells that you're going to draw. That way he can find his responses. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Because you had the image up to protect Thalnos, so Thalnos wasn't dying that turn, which is the main thing. So that the spell power would stay up, and then you could sack it after you were done with the spell Ooh, power. Ooh, soul firing and getting rid of his dire wolf at this point. No, that's a good play, though. Is it? Soul firing for tempo there is fine. Because it makes your board really resilient, and it doesn't give, uh, what is it? It doesn't give him any mana discounts. Oh, yeah. Because Sorcerer's oh, yeah, Apprentice yeah, yeah, yeah. is basically just, like, free innervate. Yep. Like, you just innervate out all your stuff, you know? Uh, we've got a couple of arcane missiles Ooh. on hand. He's going to get the guaranteed ping and not play any of them. The oh, way, because the, uh, Imp Gang, what am I talking about? The way Mello wins this game is by a high roll on Firelands Portal. That's the way you win the game. You Firelands Portal the 4-4 and you get Doomguard, 
or Earth Elemental. Earth Elemental is the 7 8 taunt. Pretty good against Zoo. Little ridiculous, shall we Let's say? See what we get. High roll. Huh. Not no. high roll. That's low. That's uh Ooh, double Malkazar's imp. Is he if he finds any discard, we're we're in a really good spot. Ooh. Or Dark Peddlers for it. Peddler into Soulfire? Soulfire is really sick. Wow, three imps. <laughs> <laughs> Are we gonna go for the triple imp? Do it. That's really that's, that's really cheeky. scary though, because every time you draw a discard like Doom Guard or something, suddenly you're drawing three. Yeah, you're you're getting your hand back. Yeah, Especially at this point of the game where he has nothing. He's gonna he's go gonna ahead pass. and save. No, he's gonna pass. Okay. I like that though, because you're playing around things like Flame Strike. Sure. Babbling book. Not Forbidden. Flame Strike. Flame Strike was the one you wanted. Yeah. Well. Yeah. So now I wonder what he's gonna do. Is he gonna Azure. Drake Double Missile? Drake Double Missile. Drake should be Double avoided. Missile makes sounds good. So does Thalnos. Thalnos Double Missile is fine too, because you can fit in the Forbidden Flame. Oh, misplay, misplay. Oh, no, never mind. I forget about the Forbidden Mechanic all the time where it takes away all your mana. Yeah. I was going to say Forbidden the yeah, Big Boss and then Missiles, but no, you Unfortunately, can't. Unfortunately, you can't quite do that. So, so we're just kind of doing wow, spray and pray. these missiles just go in phase. Uh. Wow, those missiles literally didn't clear one. It cleared one thing. <laughs> ah, wow, that's bad. Is he going to Forbidden Flame for tempo? Yeah. Yeah. That's definitely correct. But now Mr. Mega Rain is on real just lethal draws. You know, Doom Guard, POs, things like that. Lance Carrier not, is not really good. Lance Carrier is good, but it's not Ooh, what we're looking for. That's the one. That's that better. is the one. That's better. That's the one. The Argus draw is the best. Yeah, you Argus and probably Lance Carrier and keep the imps in hand. Because the imps let you draw and you want to keep your draw mechanics in hand. So that they don't get wiped out by a board clear so that you can't draw. Alright, so... He needs something sick off Cabal's Tome. Oh, I would book first, but it's okay. A ah! double counter spell in a vaporized That's not the one. Day. Babbling book into Frost Nova. That'll save you. Yeah. Babbling that... book into Frost Nova. Oh, or save mirror you. images will will nah, keep you alive. Mirror a images isn't enough. He has two. His, his answers on board are too efficient. But okay. I like the thinking. Oh, missiles again. <laughs> This is again. Let's Mel do it. Mellow's ticked. <laughs> no, because he knows they're going to go bad. He knows they're going to go bad. His last two ones were awful. All right, uh, he play, he plays the Vaporize. Plays the Vape Nation. Plays all right, the Vape all right. Nation. I think this, he might have a lethal draw here. He's got ah, he eight loses. on board, ten. Any he one damage off the top one. is lethal. Big deal, big deal. Ah, uh, he, he just, just gives gonna up. Yeah, yeah, he doesn't want to see it. He knows Scoop. It. Okay. So, Mega Rain is up 2-0. Mello is on the back foot, and I think Mr. Mega Rain again is <laughs> probably just looking to close with Druid, right? I think he's looking to close with Druid, yeah. I think he is. Because I think he played Dragon Warrior first, right? I think he did. No. No. What no, 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 no. He did, uh... Is the, is the uh, graphic not right? Was that game one? If that no. was game one, then the graphic's wrong. No, yeah, he's closing with Druid. Yeah. Dragon Warrior? Why am I... You asked. Did you just like forget? I guess I forgot. I don't know. What's Maybe my the I think the graphics off. I think you had like What's one. What's my name? <laughs> yeah, I think you had the graphic uh, set to one before the match started, and then it didn't. Then you updated it to two. But I don't know. I can go check that in I a minute. Think in the meantime, we do have ourselves our mage versus our druid. And if all things are correct, the mage should win here. Oh wait, 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 wait! Stop, stop, stop! You can just message him. I'll just message him. What game is it? Way easier than you. Yeah. Way easier than you running it. It's okay. All right. So turn one, we don't. Do we want to coin out? Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and coin out Cold Sorcerer. That's a little ballsy, don't you think? Let's make magic. Okay, yeah, this so is, yeah, it this, is game three. This yeah. is game so, three. So I yeah. just completely forgot about Dragon. Yeah, no, I know. Derp, derp, derp. Well, I mean, sometimes the games are so quick you forget, but. Wow, this is a really sick play here. He's going to Innervate Violet Teacher and then Innervate the Wrath. And honestly, you're like giving up all your card economy to make this one play. But Tempo Mage doesn't have the coin. You're getting rid of his board and you're not letting him abuse the spell power on your minions. So Now, Mello did show that he does run at least one Arcane Explosion in his deck. Oh, fuck. I just ripped myself. You wouldn't cast a spell. I wouldn't cast a spell. What did I do? I just ripped myself. As in, I, I fucked the, the, the mic. I'm not live. I'm not, I'm not we live. can hear you. It's you just. Can? Yes, we can hear Did you. I Keep turn talking. Down the volume? Keep talking. I must have turned down the volume on the uh, mic. I don't know what I did. Uh, 
Hello? No, I can't even hear myself. I can hear game sound fine. I can't hear myself though. Okay, all right, if I'm live, it's fine. I'll, I'll just, I'll play around it, but, okay. Ah, no, I can hear myself now again. Yeah, I don't know. I think I hit it on accident is okay. what happened. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. What do we yeah. got? We got a mirror image. This is really, really not looking that great for Make It Rain, because he's going to get to Cabal's Tome on four, which is crazy. Watch chat. Pull out your phone and just sit on the table and just watch chat, because Goldfin was telling you, hey, Shout out to Goldfin for uh, cheering us on over here in the booth. I'm uh, jumping on Battlefrog's back to uh, have him start reading chat, so thank you for calling it out. We've got a four damage arcane missile. Oh, wow. Completely, completely. Whoa. Oh my he god. He goes for the missiles play. I would have never done that. Oh, and he gets punished with the wrath draw. Is he going to wrath for cycle? Which is definitely correct here. You need to get both sorcerers off board. Yeah. Oh, and the double wild growth. That that hurts, but you can do a Mire Keeper wild growth turn into a giant turn. So that's okay. Now, why would you want to Wrath? Um, oh, that's what you meant by getting them both off the board. I'm stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wrath if in one, doubt, no wait for the Ooh, player. To double Cabalist. Ow, ow. That's a scary hand. What do you do here? Ooh, he finds the blast. But that, ah, oh, that's so, that's so sketchy because, like, now you just have two five mana cards sitting in your hand that like you're not going to be able to play for tempo. You, you have soon. no reaction. You you play a card and then you dice roll. You know you yeah. hope you pray. So he's going to go for the double ramp turn I think here, or he's going to go for the two two honestly and ramp. Yeah, he's going to go for the two two and ramp because he can play giant next turn either way. Yeah, I like that play way better. That's fine. That's just fine. And Yog Saron joins the Kabbalist Tome Hand. So let's see what Ooh, comes. We got, we got a forbidden. We got a Yog. We got that's... a forbidden flame, but that's not going to do us any good. We got an arcane explosion and a vaporize. The vaporize is going to do some work if we can clear off the three-three and the two-two before um, placing that secret down. He needs a good top deck for this to work. And he's got himself Ooh. a Firelands Portal. It's not the one he wanted. E -e -e. Not the one he wanted. Do you because... think he can balls now? I don't know. This is a real sketchy game. That giant changes everything. Uh. Uh, ick. Ah, man, that's really ick, tough. Ick, ick. Like, vaporize. Vapor I don't know, vaporize man. is going to take out one of the smaller yeah, minions at this good, point. It's not because you can't efficiently clear the 3 2 and the 2 2. If you could clear both of them, it would look real good here, but. Yeah, he's going to Forbidden Flame. That sucks. So now he just gets, you know, the 2 1 just, just, just wrecks his deck. Just wrecks it. Attack with the 2 2. Play around the Vape Nation. He does play around the Vape Nation. Smart. Yeah, and what sucks is that the Firelands portal it isn't in reach. You know, it oh, can't no. take out no, the... No, this giant, this giant solos the game. It's over. Ugh. Tempo Mage needs a clean answer to the Giants, otherwise they just lose. Eight damage is too much for them to... Uh... Oh, Frost Nova? No. No, no Frost Novas today. Flame, uh, Flame Lance is pretty much the only answer, I guess, but nobody runs Flame Lance anymore. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, yeah. Mr. Making It Rain sweeping the floor with this mellow. Oh yeah, second three of the day for Making It Rain. So he's he's on a he's on a hot streak. He's on a hot streak. He's uh, making it rain with the with the W's. Yeah, definitely, definitely. And definitely, that was definitely. a.